In 1921, when the CPC was founded, it had just over 50 members. Today, with more than 95 million members in a country of more than 1.4 billion people, it is the largest governing party in the world and enjoys tremendous international influence. Many foreign officials have spoken highly of the great strides the CPC has made in the development of China. They view the party's successful experience in state governance as a source of inspiration for countries across the world. على الشعب والبناء لصالح الشعب العمل لأبناء الشعب هذه النظرية العلاقة ما بين الشعب والحزب هي التي أوصلت First of all, the strength of the relationship between the party and the people This is a vital precondition for everything because unless we take seriously and listen carefully to the opinions of the masses You cannot manage to govern the country of the side of time. Secondly, the fact that the party had a vision for the future and was able accordingly to guide the country in this direction. And finally, the ability and courage of the party to learn from any mistakes and shortcomings from the past and formulate its policies based on these findings. Én nekem az a meggyőződésem, hogy a, a párt sikere két dolgon alapszik. Az egyik azon, hogy stabil értékrendet képvisel, hossz távon is tartható és jó stabil értékrendet, a másik pedig egy nagyon jó képesség arra, hogy meg tudjon. De egy حالة من القدرة على متابعة القرارات وبالذات القضايا الكبرى اللي بتحتاج سبب كبير، وأنا أعتقد ده سبب رئيس من أسباب التطور الهائل في الصين أو كما أسميها المعجزة الصينية. One of the secrets I think is the the reform agenda that CPC has come up with over the last 50 years. That issue of framing the problem. And, and creating an understanding and common vision on the problem and pulling all the resources and capabilities in such a way that these problems can be solved is one of the, the secrets behind this uh, achievement. So effective democracy that you have created, effective internal governance system that CPC has established and also improving the, the legal system of the, 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 the Chinese political arena has I think helped in, in terms of really solving the real problems of the people, which is poverty reduction and creating moderately prosperous society in China. I want to welcome the Prime Minister of 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 the Prime Minister of